Why, hello. <laughs> Pipe smokers is me, Mike. Do I have a pipe smoker here? Checking in again. Doing really well. Just like I said, I'm just trying to do more videos. That's what I'm doing. You went to Trader IPA, local brewery here in Utah. Pairs beautifully with what I'm smoking today. It's a four year old. Been cellared four years. Then he'll fight. since so many of you joined me on the package opening I did last I thought I would bring you guys along for the first smoke of my old thing Copenhagen collection smooth ants Danish pipe shop actually still has some of these available which surprises me This pipe is flipping incredible. I spent some time with it alone before before I brought you guys in, like I always do. I just have you been practicing your smoke rings? Hmm? I hope so. What an incredible pipe. Incredible tobacco, too. Naturally sweetened by time. Crystals forming. It's a little dry in the tin, so... But it wasn't terribly dry. So I didn't want to do anything drastic. So I just put the tin, still sealed, well, it's been open, but with the top on, in my humidor with my cigars. It's been in there for about a week. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. And then rubbed out perfectly. And then happens to be a perfect pipe. I don't quite know how, but I've had a hard time exp explaining it in the past, um, just with words, how to describe the difference between a higher grade pipe and, let's say, a factory pipe. Um, You don't really know until you have both and go between the two of them. The draw on this pipe is absolutely perfect. It's perfect. Near flawless. I mean, it just, it is flawless. It's just, I mean, you saw it's almost gone out twice. Quick tamp, a couple puffs. It's back on again. It's not all pipe. I pack the pipe very well, too. But even a perfectly packed pipe, if you're lacking aerodynamics inside, the draw is just not there. Um, it's not going to stay lit as well. There really is nothing like a really good tobacco through a really nice pipe. I mean, it's just it's the way it is. 
we won't get into debating on pricing on these pipes or anything because I don't know if there's ever going to be a right answer to that. I will tell you, these should be more. Tom Elting's made pipes for 40 years. Tom Elting is a master pipe maker. And these pipes are <laughs> yeah perfect this is going to be a really good smoke I could sit here in silence the whole time and let you watch but I don't think you guys would want to stick around for that um, but I will let you know a couple of things I am in process of doing drinking that don't want to puff on this for a minute hold on I'm gonna show off with some rings I've been practicing too and then I'm gonna set this down as much as I hate to. I want to set it down in my live well, live free leather works. Got these TPC leather with a key fob. These are on uh, tobaccopipecollectors.com Holds a pipe beautifully. You put it down in that. I got something from Denmark again. This time from Eric Nording. It's a new Ericsson. You can't read that. Keystone filter pipe. Stoked to be reviewing this pipe for you guys. I'll show it to you in this video and I'll go over it really well in the next one. But there it is. Okay, it's not the most beautiful pipe in the world. Hard nylon. I mean, you can see it's been formed in a form. Pre-made stem. Stem's not bad, though. It's actually pretty comfortable. Decent draw. I mean, it's not terrible at all. The reason I'm picking it apart like this is because these retail at the Danish Pipe Shop right now, and they'll be all over the place before you know it. 36 bucks comes in that bag with the Norden Keystones. I've been smoking with these for quite a while in regular pipes um, on some of the, the moisture uh, blends and certain pipes that just seem to hold a little more moisture than others. Um, you drop a couple of those in the bottom right in the foot of the bowl, uh, you're not running a pipe cleaner ever throughout the whole smoke and then you just dump it out with your tobacco well in these mr nording and his son knud have developed a filtration system using the keystones now unlike the falcon this just presses in so you don't have any threads to go bad it's got a simple rubber band easy to replace draw holes on the very bottom of a briar finished bowl the bottom of the plastic is a little cyclone well you put the keystones in there stoked i really am stoked to uh to do a review on this for you guys 36 bucks retail this is a Perfect throw around, you not know, have to worry about just from what I'm gathering, just a smoker's pipe is what it is. And that's what Eric designed it to be. It is not a collector pipe by any means. A different looking, just 
smoking machine. Um, thinking they did a pretty good job. I mean, you can drop this thing, beat the crap out of it. It's just gonna smoke. And you can just smoke it. I'll go into more detail during the review. Um, two new makers added to the website as of, well, they're not added yet. They're available. Um, go to Facebook. Um, if my editing software worked, I'd throw some pictures up. But uh, Solomon Pipes and uh, Edwin Pipes. You've got 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 pipes between the two of them. Solid, solid pipes. Really nice ones. Um, and they're in the price range from 180 to 3 something. Some really nice ones. Uh, keep your eyes open on the website for those. We'll jump on Facebook. I put a picture of them up. You can email me if you want them in advance. I always offer a special deal if you catch them before they get to the website. I think we have three or four more makers coming. Just signed Georgi Tordov with Getz Pipes from Bulgaria. Have a day-night set of reverse calabash smokers coming. Sick. Sick. This pipe kicks ass. Just so you know. Thunder. The Danish Pipe Shop still has some available. Jump on them. The Copenhagen Collection by Tom Eltang. Specifically for the Danish Pipe Shop. Okay, I went over 10 minutes. I don't like to do that. I'm probably losing a bunch of you as we speak. <laughs> wicked, wicked good. New ink. Pipe smoking skull. And, in saying goodbye, I'll give you a few of these. A few of these. And we'll say, Sweet smoke!